Hear ye, hear ye, presenting the Music Station Radio Hour. Music Station Radio Hour. Music Station Radio Hour. Hello, this is your announcer, Avon Joe. Here's your host. Papon Tata. Cool, and we're back. Hello. Uh, we've Hello. got right here Hello, in the studio. That's right. We are we're back in uh, Music Station Radio Hours Vast Cavernous Studios. Vast Cavernous. With uh, a band by the name of Underhill. Underhill. What's up, Underhill? What's up, Underhill? Not much, boys. Woo! That's all right. It's very nice having you here. Um, Thanks for coming out and playing. We've got uh, three guys three that guys. that smell like seventeen. That's right. <laughs> Well, I don't know how old they are. <laughs> oh, 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 that's very funny. Yeah, and then we got yeah. some groupie here too. Yeah, no doubt. I He's always here. About. No. Uh, we've got James on bass. James on bass. How you doing? Good, good, good. Um, for once, we have someone that's shorter than us in the that's studio. That's right. That's true. We we never have any. Everybody we have in, it, it, they're always like seven and a half feet tall, and we feel that's tiny. right. Are you sure? Because I think I might be a little taller than you are. Nope. You're not. I think so. Sorry. No, you're not. Sit down. I'm not even wearing my heels, dude, and I'm taller than you. That's right. I got my special, uh, yeah, lifts on my bare feet. <laughs> That's right. Don't make me laugh, man. I just have my wisdom teeth out. It's Papa just me. had some dentures oh, set. I apologize. Oh, it's it's hurting. I had, I had three out of four taken out. Ow. Don't you still have all your wisdom teeth, James? Yes. Yes, you actually, still I do. Really? Yes, I do. I hate dental work. I have my wisdom <laughs> teeth. I have my... Uh, Esophagus. Your what? Your esophagus. Still have that. How about your uvula? Oh, I, still have, I still have that. You got your uvula too. I still have my that. kneecaps. All right. <laughs> Mucus membranes. What All about right. Doug back there on drums? Doug's on the drum. D- Doug, uh, do you do you still have your uh, wisdom teeth? I have everything. I'm fine. I'm great. <laughs> <laughs> what about you have your everything? esophagus? Have my esophagus. You still have your esophagus? Yeah. That's good. And uh, what about you, Doug? Uh, or no, I just talked to Doug. Joe. Talk to Doug on guitar. What's up, Joe? What's up? Nada. Do you have all your wisdom teeth? Three and a half. Three and a half of them. You had half of one fall off? We can't talk about how that happened. <laughs> all right. See? Well, you know, uh, Joe's missing something, but people are going to have to call in and guess what Joe is missing. That's right. Joe know, from Underhill. No, you don't know. You don't know. Well, you don't know. You have to get on your cell phone and call us. That's right. <laughs> you have to call us. <laughs> Otherwise, we can't tell you what he's That's missing. That's right. Joe's missing something, though. Uh, man. Underhill. Real- what's, uh, where did Underhill come from? Um, actually, it was a, a word that I just I know it's a over, word. I know it's a word. I could see it. You know, by I was, was like reading a book. It's actually kind of a is famous... Is it Tolkien? Uh, is it Tolkien? Yes, it is. And is it Tolkien? It's, it's, oh. Yeah, and uh, actually, Neil Ooh. Young used to use it as a... Uh, what? As a... Uh, as a what? Booking for... Uh, Metaphor? Like hotels no? and stuff. He would go under it as an oh, alias. Oh, Mr. Underhill. Oh, oh that's right. Mr. I've heard his name somewhere else. Too. Yeah, that's There's kind of somebody it, else. too. Gotcha. Well, cool. And so you guys are secret agents. Somewhat, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Wow. Uh, we, See, I hate we use We use our powers oh, for stop making me evil laugh, instead man. of good. <laughs> this is like torture. <laughs> I, I keep laughing, and it's like, man, I'm I'm in so much pain right now. Okay. It's ridiculous. Right on. And, 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 oh. and Underhill, uh, is Underhill, this is a West Side band, is it not? West yes, Side. this is very West true. Side. Representing. Represent. Check it out. Joe house. just did the sign. I didn't even tell him wow. to. He just did the sign. He just did the right sign. Right on. Well, I didn't yeah. even know we were in the same game. Yeah, if you turn that over, it's uh, Missouri. <laughs> That's right, it's Missouri. You know, and, and, and if we were in the same gang, we would be polar opposites. He would be. Yeah, I mean, because Joe's missing something. Joe is missing something. <laughs> what is Joe missing, is Joe missing that Tautai has? That's right. Man, I can't even talk today. I had my wisdom teeth out last Thursday. So right before the last week's show, I had them pulled. I had three of my four <laughs> wisdom teeth pulled, forcibly removed from my head. Ow. And Ow. Uh, fortunately, I don't remember it because uh, they gave me some laughing gas. And, cool. Cool. and then and then they gave me some anesthetic. And It'd I woke, be cool if they let you take that stuff home with you. Well, they let me take some home, so I'm, I'm kind of loopy from some painkillers right, right now. Right on. Right but on. Uh, hey, let's go ahead and uh, and do a song, and and uh, maybe the painkillers are kicking by then. What's what's the name of the first tune you're going to do for us? Uh, I think we're going to do a little tune called Fail Safe. Fail, Fail Safe. safe. Right, Another this, CIA operative song. Is this Somewhat is this one yet. that's uh, available on a CD? Um, we have not. We have yet to record this song. Wow. Actually, uh, it will be the next in once line. again. Wow. Music exclusive. Station Radio Hour brings you exclusive, exclusive. Material, material from the local music scene. That's right. Uh, right here, Underhill. presenting uh, a track that very few have heard from Underhill. Go ahead, Mister Underhill. Go ahead, guys. <laughs> with 
CIA type song. It was. I'm thinking of. I, I could. Uh, I could. I could see that being like on the next James Bond soundtrack. Yeah. James hey, Bond hey, did you hear or... they're gonna replace him? Oh yeah. Who, uh, yeah. Let me think again. Here. They, they were talking about Ewan McGregor, which I don't think. Yeah. They were talking about Jude Law, which maybe. Uh, maybe. Wow. What do you got? You guys watch James Bond? Oh yeah. yeah. Uh, Roger Moore is always gonna be the one for me. Really. Wow. Really? Nah, really not. I'm you, just kidding. You ever. don't hear that. <laughs> He's back pedaling. <laughs> don't make me laugh, dude. Not it's really. my wisdom teeth. They're not killing really. me. No, if, if it wasn't Sean Connery, it wasn't James Bond, really. Yeah, well, I sure, don't know. Sure. I mean, I mean, the new guy, and I say new guy, and he's been around for, you know, 15 years doing James Pierce? Bond. Pierce? Pierce. Man, he, he is really good. Pierce I mean, is I good. Think, I, I like think Pierce he's, as a Bond. Yeah, he's definitely cool. I yeah. dig him. Uh, Remington Steel, though, I think. No doubt. Uh, it, wasn't that, that what... That was what he was. That was what he was. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's what he was. Yeah, you can't. Uh, you can't. Uh, what What do you think, Joe? Who Who do you think should be the next uh, James Bond? It's all right. You uh, know, take your time. We got an hour. Let's see. <laughs> I think Doug Long should be the next James Doug Bond. Doug Long. Doug Long. And who's wow. Doug Long? I'm uh, sorry. I'm that, probably the bass player. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Is your last name Long? Is that your last name? Yeah. Oh, no, the, that's the drummer, dude. What is Doug? Oh, Doug. Oh, man, I'm Joe sorry. is the guitar player. Wow, I'm all mixed up. There's I'm only mixed three up of them too. here. I, and see, I'm nobody all remembers up. the well, bass player. Well, you know player. why it is? It's because they keep moving around. That's what it is. They keep playing. <laughs> the drummer actually brought in uh, this platform on wheels, 
And as they play, uh, the other two guys have him like attached to their straps, and they're like <laughs> moving like around in around circles in the studio. It's very weird. Uh, it's it's the strangest show. Uh, you guys definitely, all of our listening audience should go see him because this is unlike any other performance really? I've ever seen. Really? Underhill. Underhill. It was a very cool band. I got. We'll that, sell you the whole I seat, got that but you'll CIA only need the edge. Samurai thing through that last song. Yeah, uh, I, was, I was feeling like I wanted to chop somebody's head off. So I, I got a question <laughs> for you, yeah, multiple James. Uh, now, now. Most people that are listening probably wouldn't guess. Not only are you the bass player and the shortest member of the group, but you're also the lead <laughs> singer. Yes, I would be all three of those, actually. <laughs> That's excellent. No, we're, right. we're not picking on you. Very accurate. Oh, no, no. We're just trying to, you know, give people an idea of what they look like. Because this is radio. Has the longest hair. Unless, well, besides me. Well, my I mean, hair's in pretty the long. band. Oh, in the band, yeah. In the band. And yeah. I have facial hair, and that counts. That, that's true. I used to have Everybody facial hair. Everybody has facial hair. I don't. He doesn't have facial hair. Everybody in this room has does, facial does hair. Does <laughs> nose hair count as facial hair? It's on your face. Yes, it does. Okay, well, then I have plenty uh, of facial hair. i got some hair. of that. <laughs> Very nice. It's those dreadlocks coming out that yeah, I worry about. What, yeah. They're not supposed to be dreadlocks. <laughs> all right, all right. Don't make there. me laugh, man. It's my oh, wisdom, dude. Okay, sorry, we're supposed to have a very serious show it's tonight. It's a serious show because, tonight. That's right. Because Papal's in pain. So don't you guys, do you have any fears? One of my biggest fears is the dentist, and I'm sorry I keep talking about that, but <laughs> it's obviously it's very thing. much on my mind. I'm just about with you, man. The dentist scares the... Really? Living daylights out of me. Yeah, oh, another James Bond movie. Oh, there you go. The Living Daylights. <laughs> See? <laughs> See, it all keeps coming around. It's the Dennis James Bond. Dennis. It's, you guys know I'm, the James I'm Bond theme? You there. Can you play wow, the James Bond theme? Oh man! Come on, it's like dude. I can five think notes. of it. I can think of it. <laughs> dude, I can think right. of it. I don't do it in ding, 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 ding. See, that's the guitar part. Yeah, uh, yeah. I'm yeah. doing Joe's part right now. <laughs> but, ding, uh, ding, 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 ding. Okay, so uh, I didn't have anybody's last names. James, what's your last name, man? Johnston. James, James Johnston. Johnston. That Johnston. sounds like a pro football player name. It does. It does kind of. Or a and porn it's odd name. Because you're, you're closer to the football than a pro football player, really. I'm sorry to say. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Another thing. I mean, thing what with comes short, down to it, man? It's, short yeah. joke. Thing. Yeah. Well, I've see, Tata normally takes the brunt of the short jokes. That's right. Because I am quite the hobbit. That's right. But, dude, you're like. You're like the Hobbit of Hobbits. Yeah, you should see my feet. <laughs> oh, yikes. Although you don't, don't want to see your feet, it, man. Yeah, if you want to see. Put your Hobbit. shoes back on. Uh, oh, oh, really? Oh, they are oh, hairy. Man. Hairy uh, feet. Hairy that's disgusting, feet. man. Put your shoes back. Although, on. Although you know, usually I the meant bass to cut player... my nails today too. <laughs> <laughs> he has claws. I forgot all about and it. Claws. So what were you saying, Tata? God, coming here. He doesn't look uh, that you know slight in stature uh, in, in stature when you have the bass on. No, usually you could tell. It's kind of like it's kind of like Prince. You know when you see footage of Prince, he doesn't look like he's like three foot two. Yeah, no. the, the bass adds an inch or two. I think that's right. Possibly. That's People right. look and you just go, wow. He okay, must be so really big. Doug back there on drums. Doug's on drums. Uh, what, what's what's Doug's last name? Long. He doesn't he doesn't have a he doesn't have a mic. Oh, Doug no, Long. Doug oh, Long. That's right because he's going to be the next James Bond. Next James Bond. And then it's Joe on guitar. Joe. Yeah. Is, what's Joe's, your last name, Joe's Joe? Adkins. Joe Adkins. Adkins? As in the diet? As in the diet? Or is that Atkins? The only diet uh, that Atkins know is uh, the low-carb diet, which we started, and uh, franchise are available. Throughout. I'm not even sure what's going on. <laughs> Joe's, like, Joe's freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> Joe's going into some <laughs> other alternate <laughs> universe. <laughs> What that was? It was like suddenly there were words coming out and he knew he couldn't stop them. It's like, whoa. Just, uh, take luck. Uh, take luck. You too. <laughs> he, started, he was in some alternate plane. I don't know where he was Once going again, at. Joe's missing something. So That's right. uh, tell us what, uh, what Joe think? is missing. Joe's missing. Because uh, he has words that flow and uh, he thinks <laughs> that the drummer would make an excellent next James Bond. I like this guy. But Doug's doing stuff like when we're not playing yeah he's like doing stuff with his hands and stuff well it's because he's a drummer it. is most, that what it is most drummers have to be fiddling if, if you notice at least you can like always rocking tell back and forth like, like you some can, of the people i see at the bus stop <laughs> he forgot to take his <laughs> which bus do morning? you ride tata <laughs> i ride three i have to catch three buses to get here <laughs> <laughs> no uh you know you can always tell which kids in kindergarten are going to be the drummers in the class because they're the ones that are always 
you know, on the desk da, da, constantly. Da, 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 da. Riddling. You know, they're riddling. Always, yeah, Ritalin. Ritalin and, come to mind? They're no. the ones that, you know, are always in trouble, always in the detention hall. Duck says he's not on Ritalin. I think he, that's what the problem is. He's not on Ritalin? No. He, he just, it. oh, it is the problem, that he is. says. He needs Ritalin. He needs Ritalin. Yeah. So uh, what song are you guys going to do? Once again, Underhill performing for us live in the studio. Got to stress to you guys, everything it's we're live. doing is live. This isn't a CD. These dudes are here playing live. for us. Uh, we have lots of people in our listening audience who don't believe this is live. This is live, My baby. This is about as live as you can hey, get. Hey, right now, just play a bass note. Go ahead. See? Listen to that. That's All right, stop, stop, note. stop. What is that? That's like eight notes. I, I can't help it. I See? Now, did you hear that? That, that was live. He did it right live. there when right I requested. Turn that over. And I hear a hiss. I think that's a guitar thing. So, <laughs> <laughs> And then he turns it off. <laughs> That was because my it's grill right. is leading into the Mesa Boogie's grill. I know it's. I all can't right. believe there's a there's a like a Mesa stack in here. Yeah, well, I mean, it's got its own room. I mean, True. this is a huge studio, dude. Yeah, it's it's huge, but it's it's large enough that they have a drummer on a cart that they can carry around. Around, so, so you should get hydraulics on that. Yeah, you should. It's very. That'd yeah, be cool. I think they're jumpers, going to, but it makes too much noise. Oh yeah. yeah. All right, so here we go. Underhill, Underhill. Uh, performing what song? Uh, this is a song called Grace. Grace. A song called Grace. Okay, go ahead. Fall from Grace, guys. Good though. All right, I think I got two questions on this thing. For all right, all right. Oh, sorry about that. I didn't mean to mack you in the head with that. And that's all right, man. No, you weren't talking. Nor did I. You know, it's like yeah. I'm standing up, and the guy comes to my waist. What am I supposed to say? <laughs> Anyways, stop okay. with the short okay. jokes. <laughs> so midget. So, okay, so who's who's Grace? <laughs> um, it's actually a fictional story oh, about you know no, you meet not. these people out sometimes and they it's about your neighbor well, it's, it's, there, yeah kind of yeah kind of there is no pleasing tautai because you know the only time that we had somebody in that didn't uh, say that the song that they wrote was a fictional story it was about some guy's dog 
Yeah. And uh, who was it? Was that the and Blues that Cats? True? That and, the, yeah, it was the Blues Cats. And he was, he was like, no, it's about my dog, you know? And, and then that was really bad. That and was then it was really answer. bad. Oh, you can't please Tata, no matter oh, what. Sorry. I, I set you up for that one, dude. That's right. And then, okay, I'll give us, just give us an, uh, a sampling of what you're saying in your verse there. Yeah. In the what, verse where I'm little, just that, mumbling? Yeah, your rap thing. Well, that thing is its not actually a rap. It's basically just a... I'm trying to think of something crazy that somebody that you kind of know would come up to you and say to you at a club or, you know, when you just meet them out, they've got Such some as? weird story Such about as? they, you know, just clip their fingernails, you know, or they, is that you know, what you're saying? back it. Well, that, that's sometimes things I'll say or, you Do you, you, do you know, change it each time? I, talk about, I try to, yeah. Oh, okay, I mean, cool. All right. Yeah. Is that right? I mean, it's it's, it's so really it's kind of like there, is, there is no set lyric. It's like a it's like a Dylan thing. It's always a work in progress. It's Joe, like, uh, tangled mean, up in you know, blue. Joe and Doug have no idea what he says. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, they ever. don't because I change. It <laughs> I don't all think the time. they ever know what he says. You know, yeah. I think Doug's getting the short end of the deal because he keeps talking. He's talking over there, and Tom Ty's what, sitting what, down what, and what, won't what ever say, put Doug? a mic in front of him. I'm, I'm fine back here. I'm fine. <laughs> he just waved well, me off. I'm, I'm glad that we uh, put he a mic in front of him. Just waved me off. Him. Actually, you know what? It's a wave off. Uh, you know what I think? No, I, what I think it? I think right now, um, because you got the wave off yeah. from Doug. Oh yeah, we I must think do that now. I think right now it's time that we ask the drummer a question. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and uh, right now, Tata is going to turn to Doug on I'm the drums. Turning to Doug. And uh, he's got a card in his hand from the 2004 Trivial Pursuit edition. Uh, Doug, are you ready for this question? Sure, I'm ready. All right. Yeah, it kind of looks ready. Because you don't really have a choice, you know. All right, uh, Tata, go ahead and uh, take it away. Doug, did you take it, Riddlin? Riddlin? No, that's not the question, man. <laughs> I just want to make sure before I ask All right, question. go ahead. I didn't want bouncing off the wall. Go for it. What nation enjoys the longest life expectancy... Despite one of the world's highest suicide rates, he's nodding. He's shaking his head. I hand. don't know. How about Chicago? That's <laughs> a big call. <laughs> that, is, that is one of the smallest nations in the world. <laughs> the, the nation of Chicago. The nation of Chicago. Doug, you said Chicago. <laughs> you said Chicago. <laughs> You, the, the, you do know that that's not a nation, right? Yes. It's it's one nation under Illinois, that, that you, indivisible. <laughs> it was just for up. us and our 50,000 listeners. The answer is Japan. <laughs> Japan. I'm Japan. sorry. Japan. <laughs> Slightly larger than Slightly the nation larger. of Chicago. A little bit bigger. Yeah, that's an odd question. And, and I, you know, since we've been asking these questions, I, I feel like I'm a smarter person now because I'm learning well, a lot of you weird look, stuff. You look like a smarter person. Well, I was born Asian, so I always look smarter. That's true. That's true. <laughs> that's just the way we are. You were born Asian. Yeah, we, well, yeah, I was but born I wasn't Asian always, and I then uh, genetically Asian. modified later. <laughs> that's right. I was born Asian, but I wasn't raised Asian. Oh, okay. I was, I was raised with wolves. Okay, so, so back to your fears. Uh, uh, so, uh, James has the fear of dentists like I do. Mm -hmm. uh, what about Joe? Joe, what's your biggest fear? Drowning. Dr wow. That is a serious fear. There man. he is on another plane. You know, I don't know where he is now. <laughs> Most people. No, he didn't say on a plane. He said drowning. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think he has fear of barbers. Fear of barbers? You're yes. giving it away, man, what he's missing. Oh, sorry. Uh, uh, no, but... Uh, anyway, yeah. See, most people say things like you know spiders or snakes or or the dark, and you say drowning, yeah, death. You know, I am scared of. Some death. people have fear of flying. I have a fear of drowning. Well, that's, but not of water. That's an understandable fear, man. Not have, of water. You don't have a fear of water. Not fear of water. Just just drowning. drowning. You sure, no fear of water. No fear of bathtubs. No. Are you How afraid? About a shower? Are you afraid of drowning in the nation of Chicago? <laughs> That could be scary, yeah. There's a lot of water in that nation. <laughs> they have a big lake next to it. Did, did hey. Doug say what his fears were, besides the fear of Chicago? No, come on, Doug. Uh, what's one of your biggest fears? Mine's probably as bad as Joe. He's burning alive. Burning alive. He's afraid of Joe burning alive. He's afraid of Joe burning alive. Burning alive. I, I would be afraid of Joe burning alive. Too. Have you, have How about you had when it? you're dead? Do you mind burning when you're dead? S no, because I'll be dead. Oh, there you go. And so, uh, James... Jeez. What an had, optimist. <laughs> James, have you had many guitar players spontaneously combust? Um, it's gone on record to have happened once. once. Can we wait and see if it happens? Once. Can once. we wait and see if it happens right now? Do you have to rub but him or something I'd, to get him to... Here. I've me, never put that in, you know. What are you rubbing the guitar player for? Because I'm trying to get him to... Come on, just on fire a little... 
He's not playing. <sighs> Man, I tried. I know. Now it's now it's hotter in here. <sighs> I'm Fine. sorry. Is it time already? Yeah, it is. Uh, we'll be right back with Underhill right Underhill. here on Music Station Radio Hour. This side. Music Station Radio Hour. Mullet free since 93. What was the name of that song? Uh, None Too Soon. None, None too, too Soon. What's that about? Um, Not that I wasn't just, listening to the lyrics. I was kind of no, no. Nah, right it's over. just uh, it's um, kind of a dark little thing about dark. Yeah, I know. We it, was dark. it was dark. You know, we knew uh, it was dark. I knew it wasn't like a little thing about selfishness, maybe. <laughs> or One that I really <laughs> want. <laughs> <laughs> I try not to get too heavy or anything. Yeah. Well. Oh, I see. But yet you're wearing a revolver shirt. That's right. Talk about yes, dark. Now you Talk probably when you when you uh, when you got that, uh, did you know it was the Beatles or did you buy it just because <laughs> it had the word revolver? on I it? I thought it was Velvet Revolver. Oh, oh Velvet! I and see. then I made the mistake once well, I'd think, already I think, walked out. I think of the James store. is older than what we think. You think so? I think he's older than what we think. Well, uh, I, I, I don't. Think he's, he's he's probably old enough to appreciate the Beatles. I think you know. I think that the youngest member no, of the group, not at all. No, definitely, not. is Doug. <laughs> Sorry, no, I'm not that old. I think I think Doug's the uh, youngest member of the group. How old are you, Doug? Twenty nine. Twenty nine. Get out of here. No way. 29. 
You're you like an, are lying. You're Get like gong this guy. You're okay, gong. <laughs> Very nice. You're lying. Uh, you look like an old fourteen. Maybe. Yeah. You look like that you, guy. You get that, you get carded a lot, don't you? Yes, I do. Yes, you do. You look All like right. that guy that gr- started growing facial hair in junior high. Yeah, that one guy that had the wispy little half mustache. Yeah, and uh, nah, it was it was after high school actually. Wow, man. You're and, not uh, 29. Uh, I would I would <laughs> pick Lion. No offense, but I would pick James as being the oldest guy in the group. Are you the oldest guy in the group, James? No, I am not. Wow, oh. how old are you, James? Gone I'm 29 off. as well. You're 29 yeah. as well. Oh, that just brings it down to one Whoa. more person, doesn't it? Uh-oh. That's right. The guy that's missing something, which turns out to be age, it's Joe. <laughs> Joe. Yes. How old are you, bud? 31. Hey, I heard a dog. I hear dogs, too. Hey, what's up, dog? <laughs> I smell up dog. What's up, dog? I don't know what's up with you. Oh, it was really bad. <laughs> Who's got a joke? Who's got a joke? Oh, hey, come hey, on. You know Ryan's in the room. Who's got a joke? Come on, just uh, just raise a hand here. Who's no got joke, a joke? No joke. Oh, no. come on. This is not a, I'm, trying, I'm trying to think. Don't be one. lame. I thought you guys... I thought you I guys, guys are I funny. I could probably think of a joke, but okay. I wouldn't fun. be able to tell it right. All right, James, I, I have a joke, but you have to play along with me, all right? Certainly. Okay, knock, knock. Who's there? Interrupting pirate. Interrupting pirate. <laughs> That's killer. <laughs> I like that. Oh, thank you. Uh, thank you very nice. pirate. That was told yeah, to me. I, I'd tell that, but I would never remember it. Uh, <laughs> I'd be uh, like, rude rude interrupting pirate. pirate. <laughs> you say, uh, <laughs> wait a minute. You know, this this past wait, weekend, say, again. this past weekend, I, I went uh, camping, and uh, we met some other friends up in Michigan, and uh, <whistles> yes, that's Tata being annoying. <laughs> And had nothing to do with camping. That's my camping but, song. But he he had several of those kind of jokes. It's just my favorite. You know the uh, uh, why does an elephant uh, wear red tennis shoes? Why? So he can hide in a cherry tree. That's right. You know. Have you ever seen an elephant in a cherry tree? No. Nope. See, it works. Red tennis shoes. Yeah. You know. Always he, funny. He had all of those. It was all of those. You know, six year old jokes. Even though he was like four, was he, he was way ahead of his time. Was he telling That's him at like four o'clock in the morning? No, he wasn't. He was actually very good. He went to bed by seven. Woo. And uh, that was back before I thought I was actually going to have to go to the dentist, <laughs> which which well, brought up my dentist, w- right. worst fear. Back to the throbbing. Do you have any Do you have any songs that you play with like a dentist drill or? Uh, do we have anything like that? I'm trying to think. Anything that um, Anything that would remind me, or how about something happy? You have a happy song? Hey, you know what you guys want? You guys said you did a song, and you guys did it a little bit in the sound check. I want you guys to do that. Oh yeah, that was kind of cool. It's very it's, weird. I think it's like gonna that. it's gonna be very surprising to the audience. And That's I think true. the first person that could identify this song within one note or whatever it takes. <laughs> guess what song this is? Tell us what artist this is too. Yeah. I mean not not Underhill. We know Underhill's playing this song, but <laughs> uh, this is gonna be a, this is gonna be a cover. So uh, yeah. yeah. This is this is interesting, and and I was kind of impressed because they do all originals except for like two covers, two and covers. this is one of the two, which is uh, fascinating. Obscure, to me. very obscure. Obscure to say. Well, you know, it's obscure for, for a three this, piece, definitely <laughs> for three piece all male. Yeah. So all right. Well, I didn't even check. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Are you doing a check like now? I know, I Tata, stop that. Cough, Joe. They they okay. can <laughs> they can uh, <laughs> sue for that kind of thing. That's right. Okay. All right, go ahead. Here we go.
That's cool. That's cool. Sade. Two. Sade. Oh, you know, no. the unfortunate thing is if she does like a... Uh, a, a tribute album. Yeah, that, that, that's probably the only song there is, really. No, yeah. well, she had tons of songs. She had man. tons of songs, but I don't know. Well, she had. Uh, what about smooth? I always thought it was oh, smooth operator. You guys, you guys don't do Sade. smooth operator, do you? I always thought it was Sade. 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 What the hell is wrong with you, boy? <laughs> You've been on the West Side too long. Don't, don't you watch them music awards? They tell you Come every on time. Now. Come Everybody on now. Everybody knows it's Shaw Day. Shaw Day. S A D E. Shaw Day. I had it wrong all this time. <laughs> That's right. I do that band say, dude. That would be yeah, like. Run, uh, run away. That know? would be like, you know, uh, us pronouncing your name like Hamez. Hamez. Hamez Johanniston. That's right. Hamez Johanniston. I like the sound of that. You should go back to your name, dude. Hamez. Hamez. I spell it J A M E S. Hamez. It's much more interesting than it normally is. Well, I mean, if she can if she can spell it S A D E and pronounce it Chardet, you could be Hamez easily. Yeah, I think. I learned a lot of Greek in the last couple weeks because I was watching the Olympics a while back. Hamez Johanneton. <laughs> See? I'm all about that's, it. You sounded like a you the sounded answer. official. That's you right. Did. Bronze medal like winner. James Johnston, 100 meter dash. That's, that's right. Like that. Dude, how long is that going to take? Hamez Johanneton, 100 <laughs> meter dash. Make, I don't think I'd make it. Four yeah. weeks, seven hours. Still working on it. 26 minutes. Still working. 32 seconds. It's a new Hamez record. <laughs> Hamez. He's all Hamez. <laughs> but, all right, go James ahead, guys. Uh, now, I'm sorry. Give me the name of that song again. Because I wasn't paying attention to you. I never do. <laughs> Overtime. <laughs> Overtime. Go for it. It wasn't exactly, I just did nine hours on my eight-hour shift song. Oh, yeah. What was that all about? 
Who is, is that what that's all about? That's kind of what it's about. So do you guys have uh, day jobs, or, or do you just uh, do this uh, full-time? musicians, unlike most musicians. We you, are working musicians. You're a working musician, so Just what does that mean? Mo- you know, when they say working musician, usually that means that, that you're... Means a full 10-hour day plus. No, usually that means that you're working as a as musician, musician, not as a day clerk at CVS or something. Not what do you do? That. Not do that. I'm a painter. You're a painter. He's a piner. I'm a piner. I'm a piner. I'm a piner and then I drew him. That's it. <laughs> and Joe? <laughs> I'm a quality technician. A qual- what is that? What do you do there? Most of our business is auto manufacturers, and it's a uh, mechanical testing lab. Joe's a mechanic and a darn good one. Does that explains why he's He's got a something. real fun weekend planned. Oh, yeah. He drives a nice car. That's it. That's it? Yeah. Okay, James. What Very do you do? Very cool. What do you do? Huh? <clears throat> I actually work at the counter at CVS. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. So, uh, what do you really do, James? Not I that we're mocking, CVS. not mocking people at CVS. <laughs> Actually, but, I work uh, at the counter. I mean, that's what I do. <laughs> and I love doing it, <laughs> and so, I love it. You know, I just got a new you guys name badge. Want to make fun of me for working the counter at CVS? <laughs> he's a that's working. What I do. He's a working musician. Isn't CVS that's one of our sponsors. I do. I yeah, CVS know. is one of our sponsors. Oh, okay, yeah, that's a good place. And they're a fine bunch of people. That's it. Well, how do people get in touch with you if they would like to book uh, Underhill? Uh, they can always go to. Uh, we have a website uh, www.underhillTheBand.com. <laughs> Underhill the, the band. band. Yeah, we had to do that because there was like cookbooks and stuff like that. that Underhill. Had the, Underhill. Uh, sure. Kind sure. of was already on top of the website thing. Sure. You know, okay. right. I just well, you sh- did you, learn about the internet. You know what you should just come what you should have called it is UnderhillCookbook.com, and then you could have then swapped we with had them. it. Yeah. You could have swapped with them. You could have been like, well, we own Cookbook, and we have nothing to do with that, and you don't have anything to do with us. So. <laughs> Underhill right. the band. I, I should have yeah. thought of that. Yeah. The band. I we, uh, you well, that's why I should be a manager. If we go to that website, what do we see? What do we get on that? Um, there pictures? We're, we're just starting to get some pictures up and info, uh, keeping it updated keeping for it real? Uh, gigs and stuff like hey, that. Hey, you, hey, we're doing a show over here. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Hey, what are you guys doing? I'm sorry. <laughs> You're not even answering my question. All right, whatever. It's I heard some sort of, of crash. There's some kind of crashing thing over there. What is it time for? It's time for that thing. Oh, for the thing where... Uh, where the bass player... Recites lyrics, and uh, Tatai um, normally has these in his hand, but he, but I handed them off. He handed them to me. So uh, actually, I'm going to hand them back to him because he's so good at this. That's uh, right. I'm handing. He's handing them back to me. And you decide the, where. That's it. A ceremonial handing off. That's right. We're going to hand these to James, our bass player and vocalist. That's right. Uh, and James, we want you to read these dramatically, poetically, artistically. Uh, like the small slice of Americana that it might be. That's right. But, they're uh, dark. <laughs> they'll do my best. They're dark. Do okay, you are you ready? Go you ahead. Ready? And uh, I need complete silence from the band except for the occasional chuckle. Go ahead. To realize my crime, let me love and steal. I have danced inside your eyes. How can I be real? Do you really want to hurt me? Do you really want to make me cry? <laughs> Precious kisses, words that burn, lovers never ask you why. In my heart, the fire's burning, choose my color, find a star. Precious people always tell me that's a step, a step too far. Do you really want to hurt me? Do you really want to make me cry? Do you really want to hurt me? Do you really want to make me cry? (laughs) Thank you, James. Thank you, James. Uh, and the immortal words of George O'Dowd. From uh, one crossdresser to another. That's right. Uh, from James right there. Uh, culture Club. Culture Club. Do you really want to really really hurt me? Really, really, really want to hurt me. Okay, now I think we should have uh, Joe do it. Karma Chameleon. Come on. <laughs> come, 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 come. <laughs> James will be walking out the studio in about oh, 15, 20 minutes. If anybody wants to come out and just smash him for doing that. Song. Yeah. <laughs> He's a, he'll be the one in the dress. Uh, <laughs> and the funny dreadlocks and a big top hat. <laughs> yeah. And yep. dancing kind of weird. That's right. Kind of the painter's outfit. Didn't he always to wear like a painter's outfit or something? Some kind of, I don't know what he Seemed wore. like it was like a big white, clown. like overall sort of splotchy. I don't know. He looks really weird now. Yeah, well. He looks really, really weird now. The two people I thought were the weirdest in the 80s were George Michael and Michael Jackson. Yeah. I think they should have just become one like George Michael Jackson. George Michael Jackson. I I think that they should have been one, and I think that they're slowly becoming one because I think true. Michael is about as white as George was then. That's true. He, uh, George Michael, I think, is darker at this is point. It? It's not George Michael. Why what are we saying George say? Michael? What did you say? It's boy George Michael boy Jackson. George. <laughs> 
Boy George is multiple colors right now. <laughs> okay, so it's Boy George is the leader of the Culture Club. That's right. George uh, Ordell. George Michael is the is the uh, Choose Life guy. Yeah. The, uh, <laughs> choose Life. Uh, <laughs> what was it? What was it? The, uh, wham. Wham. That's wham. it. Wham. I can't wham. think of a name. Wham. 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 And then wham. Michael Michael Jackson. So it's That's Boy it. George Michael Jackson. That's it. Hey, you know, I'm, I'm just going to take a, a backpedal here. Okay, and, go ahead. Uh, when you guys were, we're going to talk about the dentist, the Shaw Day, man. the oh, Shaw Day song. Yes. Uh, how did that? How'd you guys pick that one? Yeah, that Did you just walk in and say, dude, I've got a song that we should do, and then everybody just kind of went, you're an idiot. Is that, is that's that how exactly they... <laughs> the way it happened, pretty much. <laughs> we are not going it? to do that song. Pretty much, that's the way it Who happened. Who picked it? Did you pick it? I picked it. Right I picked on. it. I'm a big fan. And I like the stuff. I, I just thought the rhythm... And Joe, what was your you. first reaction to that? I thought it would be a little complicated. Uh, you know, she has quite a large band... And, That's uh, not what I thought you were going to say. And we're just three piece, so uh, look, took a little convincing, but I think it but was, it's good. It's worth it. It's fun. Yeah, it is. It is. It's, it's good. It's good. I buy that. Operator. Yeah, think of that. Spoon think of that, operator. and think of. Don't you really want to hurt me? Yeah. Don't you really? Or want to hurt me? Don't really want to hurt me? Or is it? Do you really want to hurt me? Yeah. Don't you want to? <laughs> don't you want? <laughs> don't you do you? I think you guys should just skip Don't all that and do like uh, you know some Thomas Dolby. Do some like that's right. You know, me with science. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. She blinded me with science. science. You can have some old crazy guy jump on and go science, science. Wow, wow. Very nice. No, I know. Oh, I know. I know. That could be Ryan's job. Ryan could put Ryan. on a white wig, and <laughs> and he could run out on stage and go science, science. science. <laughs> All right, so so do a, a song, idea. and I think right now in the middle of the song, Ryan should just at some point yell out, <laughs> Science! Science! <laughs> just I'll for no the, reason. I'll cue you when that happens. Okay, all right. You guys, gonna pick it. Are you guys ready? You know what song you're going to do? Yeah, I think so. All Doug's right. been playing for the last 15 minutes. Oh, well, cool. <laughs> he hasn't stopped yet. All right. Well, go ahead, guys. They're doing hand signals now. I don't know what this is.
Hey, uh, we yes. gotta we gotta go. We're kind of over time here, but uh, uh, thank Underhill. you, Underhillthebandcom Underhillthebandcom uh, Underhill We're right here on Music Station Radio Hour. Thank you for listening, uh, yeah. Underhill, right here on Music Station Radio Hour. The proceeding was a shameless plug. Music Station Radio Hour. Music Station Radio Hour.